Hello everybody, it's Larry again. So in this video, what we're going to do is actually add another menu to the top of our page here. Uh, that's actually a fairly common request. Uh, and in our 26, this is a 2016 theme, um, and it doesn't have a theme location, menu location at the top. So we're going to actually have to create a new menu location or theme location up near the top of our page above our site title. And then we're going to create a new menu, uh, maybe just put three items in it, and we're going to assign it to this new menu location. This is on your assignment, so uh, follow this uh, step by step. It's a little bit more difficult than uh, the other um, the other edits I had you do in your assignment. Okay, so first thing you're going to want to do is, if you haven't already, create a take your header file from your parent and move it over to your child theme. And I've already done that. Just leave it completely intact. Once there, let's take a look at this. Let's try to find our menu. Okay, here's our 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 nav menu. Now I guess we could let's just uh, mess around a little bit. We could take this and uh, move it somewhere up near the top of the page. Just let's see here, site inner. I'm gonna put it here to see what that looks like. Okay, and we should get a duplicate of the, and we do, and it's misplaced. Actually, I kind of like that where that's at. I think I found the right location. However, we want to create a unique menu. Okay, from this point, uh, I'm going to not give too much explanation. Just go follow along step by step. So, to create um, a new theme location for our menus, um, there is a function called, I think it's register, register nav menus. Okay. Yep. Okay. Let's take a look and see how this works. All right. Uh, okay. Go here, copy this, copy this code right here, and we're going to modify it. So what we need now is a functions.php file in your child theme so I'm going to create a new file here and I am going to save remotely and I am in my child theme I'm in my template parts folder so I come okay I want to be right here and create a file called functions.php Okay, so that's saved. Now your functions.php file, remember to put open and close PHP tags. Otherwise your site will die. And let's paste in that function call from the codex. Okay, so we need to modify a few new things. Um, I'm not gonna do a new footer menu. I am going to call this, uh, this is, let's call this top dash menu that's its computer name or its slug and then this is its display name and I'm going to say top menu okay so one thing that this register nav menus does is add a theme location to the menu section inside the dashboard let's take a look and I can look here there it is Another place to look is in Manage Locations and Top Menu. Okay, so it does consider it a new theme location, whatever that is. Okay, so now I need to create a unique menu to display in this menu location. So I'll create a new menu, and I can give it whatever name I want. I'll call it Menu B or something. And okay, before I, I well, first of all, let's add three items randomly. These look good. And assign it to the top menu theme location. Okay, let's see if that's done anything at this point. I'm expecting three menu items at the top. Didn't happen yet. Okay, so you have to go back to your header.php file. 
where you put in, where you copied that WP nav menu, this whole nav section, which should actually be properly indented here. Sorry about that. All right. And theme location. We just created a new theme location called in computer lingo, or as it's slug, top dash menu. This menu class, let's leave that alone. That actually is adding a CSS class to the element, uh, and that'll keep it looking a lot like the, uh, the, the menu below. So let's leave it like that and see what we have. There we go. There's our new menu. It's a little bit off-centered. I'm not really concerned about that. Uh, I just want you to add, be able to add it, a new menu to the top of your page. So hopefully you got to jump on this one early if you're having problems. Of course, catch me uh, before or after class or on Saturday or send us an email. Thank you.